By now, you've likely seen video or pictures of the tsunami that hit Japan today after a massive earthquake struck just off the east coast of the country, followed by hours of aftershocks. While a wall of water was building, here at home, the University of Manitoba has a seismometer that recorded the massive earthquake. Take a look as geological scientist professor Ian Ferguson explains. Okay, we're looking at the recording of the magnitude 8.9 earthquake from Tokyo as recorded at the University of Manitoba seismometer. Uh, these signals traveled from Japan and uh, started arriving here about 12 minutes after the earthquake occurred. The signals continued coming in for about uh, five or six hours after the earthquake itself um, as the signals were reflecting off the different layers in the earth. Um, it's a really large earthquake. Um, the, the limits of the trace that we can see indicate that the um, signal was recorded at maximum level here at the University of Manitoba. Hundreds of people in Japan have been killed, with many more missing. The Free Press will continue to follow this story. From the Free Press Newsroom, I'm Tanya Kohut.